Welcome back guys, episode 2, and I've made some important changes. You remember last time there were only two indus industries, these two farms here? Well, I've changed that. With the mod which allows me to place industries, they're expensive, they're like 50, yeah, about 50 grand to a million each. What I did is I turned off costs, so there was no cost, and I put in a few industries. So I put in a food processing plant up here to represent the clucking bell. I'm not putting it in Polito Bay because that causes problems if you put industries in the cities. I also put two farms here to represent grapeseed. I put, there's a power plant here in the real game, so I put an oil refinery to represent that. And I put a, a oil well where the Ron Alternatives wind farm is to represent that because there's no wind power in the game. Uh, down here where the docks are I put in a construction material plant it seemed like the best place and the rock for that I thought well rocks comes from hills so I put a plant up here where the lake normally is and that's the most important changes I've made so I think it's time to start doing some industries because we're making money at the moment if I go on the lines yeah we're making a fair bit of money that's been fluctuating quite a lot but we should be able to make some mega bucks using the industries. So let me do, just turn off the down arrows. There you go. And we're going to put in, uh, I'm thinking food, a food line. So we could use the highway, take food from Grapeseed up to Polito Bay. I think that would probably be the best. So we need a road. Uh, what I'm going to do, I'm going to put a large city street. Why is that so expensive? Okay, a medium. Yeah, that's better. And that's going to represent the highway. It needs to curve around a bit. We've run out of money. So I'm going to borrow a bit more of our loan. We're down to a million. I'm going to put that in there and curve it around the shoreline like that. And we're basically just going to put in the highway. So now I'm going to change to a large country road. And it's quite expensive. But then this is a maintenance part. Mount Chiliad's right by here. That's the tallest mountain in the game. I'm just going to put these in just to represent the highway which runs along here. I believe it's Route 13 in the game. Uh, try and make it as cheap as we can going through the mountain pass. Fortunately, there is a way carved out for us, but, you know. Uh, eight grand. Uh, this is where it gets expensive. Yeah. Fourteen. I can live with that. That's not what I wanted. No. Come on, game. Bit curvy there, but meh. Jesus. Very thin part here. Oh, no. Want it as cheap as possible. Where, where are we going? Down to there. Okay. No. <laughs> That's not what I wanted. Neither's that. Okay, it's starting to level out and widen out a little bit now. So I'm just going to bring a highway straight along there, 30,000, I can live with that. And I'm going to put a medium street, actually no I'm not, I'm going to put a medium country road across there like that. Oop, we've run out of money. Come on, make this cheap. Uh, we're going to have to borrow more. Damn, 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 damn. Oh well, not really much I can do about that, unless you want to see me sit here and wait for a year. No, it won't let me do anything with the terrain. No. I want this as cheap as possible. And I also want it as straight as I can get it, you know. Even a little bit straight would be nice. That'll do. And uh, just a small country road. Not like that, though. That'll do. Right, the food plant. Uh not what I wanted. Oh, come on game. There. Much better. Right, truck stops. We want 
freight. We've got 460,000. I'm going to let it play. Hope the money builds up. That'll do. And down here, I'm going to put a truck stop. Let's see if we can get it in the city. My plan is to get trucks to take it from there, the farm, up to the food plant, and bring it back, the food, and it will be distributed to grapeseed. I probably should have checked where the industry is in grapeseed, which is there. Uh, food goes to commercial, I think. Is it commercial? Yeah. Does that reach commercial? A little bit. It'll do for now. So, we want a line. We want some music, actually. I keep this is the one thing I always forget. That'll do. Right. Uh, what do I want? I want a line. Line manager. Our money seems to be going down. Even though we're making a fair bit. Making 30 grand on Cypress Flats to Sandy. That's finally picked up. Thank God. Right, so this line's just going to go from there over to there. Perfect. And this is going to be uh, RF, Road Freight, uh, Palito Grape, that's a W, Food. And because it's a food line, I'm going to make it a nice sparkling lime green. Oh, that's horrible. <laughs> Alright, we've got a depot by here. I'll just use this one. Buy road vehicles, horse wagon. One, two, three, just to get the line established. Uh, RF Polito Grape Food. And why have I got the distinct feeling I'm forgetting something? I know, it's me. I probably am forgetting something, but you know. So it should bring food back and forth. I just want three vehicles just to get the line established so, that, so they should go up and pick food up here. What's this stock called? Grapeseed Sidings. That is perfect. Where are you going? Grapeseed Sidings. Come on. Grapeseed Sidings. I just want to make sure none are going directly to Polito. No, they're not. That's fine. All right, lines. What are we doing? We're still making money. We need to make more money though. Uh, I'm going to help this road out here. No, not like that. Oh, New Year. There goes our loan payment, down to 300000 now. We've, met, we've lost money all these years, but I think this year is the year we're starting to make money. Hopefully. Let's just hope we don't go bankrupt. What they need as an industry is a weed farm, just to go by here. And maybe Trevor Phillips is the uh, the place it goes, you know. That music's quite loud, isn't it? Let's see if I can do something about that. Music, audio. Oh, it's on one. Ah, oh, that's odd. Oh. Well. I love the way when the camera zooms out, you can hear the sound of the wind. Right, I, I know what we can do. Are any of these up to capacity? Yes, quite a few of them, actually. So, the solution to that is vehicles. Um, Calafia Loop, I'm going to put three more on each. One, two, three. Calafia one. One, two, three. Calafia two. Uh, LS Vinewood, that uh, is zoom out. Close that, close that. Um, where's the depot? Depot's by there. By road vehicles. One. Uh, how many have we got? Six. One, two, three, four. Set line all. And this is going to be LS Vinewood 1. Cypress Flats 2. Yep, that's full. So that's got four. One, two, three, four. Put it up to eight. Uh, that one. And Pleto Bay. Uh, Polito Grape Food hasn't arrived. Oh, yes, it has. It's picked up. Perfect. That means, what's the production like up here? If it's producing well, I'll start putting more vehicles on. Yes, it is. We need to desperately add more vehicles. Buy road vehicles. Horse wagon. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Uh, these are going on Polito Grape Food. Right, we're down to our last 35,000. It just went up. So we should start getting big money soon. I really want to put a train line in. If I do, it's probably going to go across Los Santos, up and around up to Sandy Shores, maybe Polito Bay. I think that would be a pretty good line for it. As I say, I'm going to try keep this realistic, but when it comes to transport, like in the real Los Santos in Grand Theft Auto V, it's got the tram system, the underground that goes around, and it's got freight trains, that's it. Other than that, it's got buses. And I'm not exactly going to lay out every single road, every bus stop, so the bus routes are realistic, you know. Got to keep it fun as well. Right, are they, they're halfway there. They're going quite fast. What's the top speed of these? Uh, 10 miles an hour, wow. Right, where's the other ones? Have they arrived yet? Nope, they're on their way. But look at that, we've got lots of cows and corn. Bit of both, really, waiting. What's this producing? Is this producing corn or... No, it's producing cows. Doesn't really matter. I do want some other industries to get going, but we haven't got the money yet. We need to wait for this to build up. We should get a nice lump sum of payment when this arrives. What's the potential? Potential. Potential. 228. Uh, no, 60. Sorry. When that starts to pick up, though, I'm going to put a line in to Polito Bay. And when we start getting big money, I'm going to start printing my own industries, but I'm going to keep the no-cost mod on. Like, we've got 46,000. We could afford to put one in now. Realistic. Oh, it just went down. End of the month, probably. Yeah. So, you know, fair enough. Right, what's not connected? That's what I want to focus on. I want to get up to Polito Bay. And since we've got the road network in, there's nothing really stopping us. Huh. Okay, so if I was to put a line in from Sandy, go up there. Through grapeseed, we could have it divert through grapeseed. Up the highway. Ah, huh, why are we not doing that? Who knows? Right, road. Yeah, that's exactly what I want. We need to do this as cheaply as possible. That will do. That'll do as well. Screw it. If, it, if it's cheap, I'll do it. That sounded so much more wrong than I meant it to. Okay, that's not happening. Right, bus stops. Uh, no, we want passenger. My mouse is hitting my keyboard. It's always good. One, two, and I'm going to put in one, two, and one, two. Right. Grape seed. We've already got bus stops, but I suppose there's nothing stopping us adding one by there. And same with Sandy. I'm going to put a bus stop there. So we want now a line. I've been a lot more active in this series, I've noticed. Getting stuff done and things like that. So that's going to go there. 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 And then it's going to go up to Polito over Chiliad. It's going to go there. Uh, which side of the road do they drive on? The right. So I'm going to have it go there, there, and back to there. Back around here. I like that blue colour. I'm going to keep that. Chester Road, Broadway. I don't think that's the real Broadway, unfortunately. And then it's going to go to there, there, and finally there. And this is going to be RP Sandy... Perlito 1, just in case we have 2. I thought I, I thought I wrote potato then, that looks like potato to me. Don't know why. Uh, road, a depot even, buy road vehicles. Oh god, we can only afford like 3. Not even, not even 3, we need like 200, come on. There you go, 3. Do you reckon we'll get one more? I'm not sure, it's building up pretty slow. Alright, let's just put this on to start it going. So this is Sandy Polito. Close. Right, we're doing well. How's the food line doing? How are all the lines doing? 
we are not losing any money anywhere as of now. Oh, I had to open my big fat mouth, didn't I? <laughs> it's all right. When these come back, this will start making money again. Like it's it's full pretty much. Three or four food. I don't know why it couldn't get the extra bit, you know. Now we just need Sandy to Polito to start picking up people. Let's go to Polito, see if any passengers are interested in our line. Yeah, I doubt it, but you never know. Nope, nobody waiting. Via Chester Road, via Chester Road. Yeah, that's helpful. Chumash we need to connect. That's going to be a tricky one, because it's basically on an island. And we've seen how expensive the bridges get. Elysian Island, same problem. Is there anything else which isn't connected but is on the mainland? Also, saying that, Stab City was on the island and it got connected, but the thing is, we'd have to go basically right around the coast of this main in through the farm, and that's just going to be expensive. That's one problem with the ploppable industries, I think that's what it's called. Like, the farm here has fields around it, I love those little sounds. What's this one going to make? Meh. <coughs> <laughs> that was a great sheep. Yeah, it doesn't have the fields or anything, which it would be nice to have the fields. But there's not really much I can do. This food waiting, that's a good sign. These need to spread out a little more, these vehicles. What's the production at? 224. Perfect. Right. Oh, wow, we're up to 40,000 again. Right, how's the Sandy Polito doing? Still losing money, no passengers. That's not great. Anything up to capacity. God, LS Vinewoods are back up. The Calafia Loops need more as well. Jesus. Okay. Buy road vehicles. One, two. How many's on there? Twelve. Uh, three. Not enough money. Damn. Okay. You. Uh, go on Calafia 1, and you, dear sir, go on Calafia 2. Every little helps. Oh, oh, that was that graphics glitch then. I hope the screen didn't just turn red for you guys. It's annoying, because on here it looks fine. It's just literally a flash of light. But on the recording, it's it just turns the screen red, and I have no idea why. Also, I'd just like to say, look at this. Cypress Flats is expanding across the river. That is perfect. That's exactly what we wanted. Right, we've got 14,000, 15. What's the day? It's the near the end of the month, so I'm going to buy a vehicle. As you know, what I'm going to do, uh, LS Vinewood. Just pause briefly while we come down here. Depot is there. Buy road vehicle. Actually, no, I'm going to wait until after the end of the month, otherwise they'll take charges out on the vehicle we just bought, even though I haven't had time to pick anybody up. Right, just did it. Waiting for it to get up to 13,000. Come on, game. That's the thing. It starts off slow, this game, but it builds up quick. 10,000 and 13,000. There you go. Set line, LS Vinewood. Right, I want to have a look at the 10 populations. Currently top is Los Santos with 595. Uh, bottom is Polito Bay, surprisingly, even though that's like the second largest town in the game. Then I suppose this has areas of Los Santos with a separate town, so it's kind of fair. Oh wow, back up to 16,000, 19, 20. Perfect. And it's the end of the month, so bye bye, Cash. <laughs> I'm going to try and spend as little as possible. Let's see how the food line is doing. I don't want to put in a ton of lines at the moment. I want to get a train line going soon. But that's going to be tricky. Right, Polito Grape Food is full. That means... By road vehicles... One. Uh, how much are they? 13,700. Nearly there. No, not quite. 70. Oh, the loan payment's about to come out. Damn. Oh, 100 there. This is going to kill us, this loan payment. It really is. December 23rd. 
Merry Christmas everyone, December 25th, my birthday. Seriously, I was born on Christmas. One in 365. Although we, that's not the weirdest birthday in my family, believe it or not. My brother and my cousin, uh, my auntie and my mum went into labour at exactly the same time. They were taken to the same hospital and born within five minutes of each other, opposite each other in the same ward. Yeah, what's the chances of that one? I'm guessing over one in a billion. So, yeah, that's pretty rare. Right, we are massively negative now. But we are making 35,000 on the uh, Polito Grape Food. That's good. That needs a more catchy name. It's a nightmare saying that all the time. Uh, the P P PLT. No, PTB. Grape. Nailed it. Right, now we just need some cash to build up, so I'll bring you guys back in a moment. Okay guys, so I was looking around, waiting for the money to build up, and one thing became frighteningly apparent. The food line is currently what's carrying us, by, by which I mean it's making more than double the next best line. You can see it's making nearly 80,000, and the next best line, the Calafia Loop 1, is making 30. Like, even both Calafia Loops combined at the moment are making less. So, we need to start expanding our food production. So, what I'm going to suggest, now we've come back positive, is to start putting food into Polito Bay. Or maybe, maybe Sandy Shores. I think it's Sandy would be better, because... To do Polito Bay, we'd need to have more vehicles taking it up and they wouldn't be bringing as much back each. So they wouldn't make as much money. And the ones to Polito Bay from the food plant wouldn't bring anything back so they'd make half as much as they potentially could. That's what makes this line here so successful, the, the food line, is that it's taking food, taking like, is it cows? Yeah. It's taking cows there and bringing food back. So it's getting money each way. So, we need to start looking at a Sandy Shores line. So, where is the industry in Sandy Shores? The commercial even, right, that's perfect, it's on that side. So, I'm going to put a... Yep, yeah, this. I'm going to put one of these, whatever they're called, what are they called? Truck station. In there. I'm going to turn it around just a touch. Like that. And we can use that truck station. So now we just need a new line. So you, pink line. Ooh, I like pink. <laughs> that thing is so gay then. Not that I got a problem with that. I know someone's probably going to interpret my words. So there and back. This is going to be RF F Sandy Food. That's foods. Could be worse. Could put an F on the end. <laughs> and we need a truck for that. It's the 29th, pause, the 30th now. Uh, buy road vehicle, horse wagon, one, two. Can we get a third? I doubt it. Never know. Nope. Right, so put two on just to get the line going. Sandy food, our first pink line. And... That should be that. I've also had a thought about our train line, which we're not going to put in yet, but we're going to do it soon. What my plan is, in the real game, the line runs along the river, and then it curves around, and it goes along the highway around the outer edge here past the power plant. What my plan is, I really want a terminal on Elysian Island on this bit that sticks out. Don't ask me why, I just do. I was thinking of putting it there, have the tracks cross the river down here and then it's going to go up along this side of the river through this highway where this highway would be and it's going to go up here around through Braddock Pass over here where the highway is into Polito Bay 
and then maybe continue on back round to Chumash or something like that. I'm also going to have a line running west to east, so starting near Del Perro, maybe Chumash, going across, and that one is going to take the outer highway and join up about here and then go to Sandy Shores. It'll be something along those lines. I haven't thought it out fully yet, but that's what I'm planning. Look at that, we've got 40,000 now. So what needs vehicles? Uh, the food line, mainly. And Cypress Flats to... LMSA, what is that? La Mesa. That is, that's in the city, that needs vehicles. I'll do that now, actually. Calafia Loop keeps going up and down. It, it does need vehicles, though, I think. So I'm just going to buy two and LMSA. The shortest line we got, essentially. And October 29th. I'll let the payment go out, why not? Should take us down to, yeah, about 25, I was going to say. Buy road vehicles. And I am going to buy... Oh, wow, we're making 100,000 now on the food line. One, two... Can we get another one? No. Set line. The food line. Perfect. God, the money's actually rolling in quite quick now, isn't it? I think we're going to do well in this game. I don't want to jinx it, but I think we are. It's 1854. Fair enough. Right, anything else need vehicles? LS to Vinewood does. Um... Huh. Okay. That's this depot. I probably should put more depots in, but I don't really care. One. Can't afford another one. Can we? Is it going to build up quick enough? I think it might. Ten. Nearly. Nope. Damn. Set line. You're going on there. Close that. Right, we need to start putting train lines in. The problem with train lines is ev the cost of everything is multiplied. They cost more to put in, they cost more maintenance, they cost more to buy, but they can make huge sums of money. I've seen train lines make hundreds of millions. So, I'm not expecting that this early, maybe when we get to the 2000s, but... That's the problem with train lines. They're ridiculously expensive. Um, Sandy Food still isn't making anything. Check the depot, see if anything... No, that's a vehicle. Uh, yeah, that's what I wanted. Right, there's nothing there for grapeseed food... Uh, for Sandy Food yet, so I'm going to leave that. It's 1855. There goes our loan payment. We're back down to minus 80,000. That's not good. I probably should put it on slow speed, but then the money wouldn't build up as fast. Maybe when we start getting trains and there's more stuff to look at, I'll start putting it on slow speed. I do think we need to connect Elysian Island, though. Uh, how much would it be? Yeah. 400, probably 5 if I put the nice, 6 if I put the nice bridge. Uh, no, I didn't think that would work. So, 400,000, why if we were to get connected straight up? Yeah, that's not what I want. That's quite cool though, the way it gives us a viaduct. I think that's a mod, I put a viaduct mod in. That's pretty cool, if I was to raise it up. That's actually pretty badass. Expensive, but badass. I like that. The simple things for simple minds, eh? Right, we near positive? No, halfway. Sandy food, why are you not getting anything? Um. Huh. Is there anything waiting? No. It's going there, that's a truck stop. And that's in range of the commercial. And commercial is where food goes. So, what? Huh. Why would that be doing that? 
That's not good. Perhaps we just haven't had time to register yet. I'll give it the benefit of the doubt and say that's what it is. If it doesn't start working though, I'm going to have to do something about it. Well, OCD is telling me these need connecting. Ah, uh, I'm going to money, son of a biatch. It's just 2,000, that's all I need. That's irritating. Uh, I've still got, how much have I got in the bank? I've only got half a million. I don't think that'd be enough to put a train line in, unless we put a little one in. From Cypress Flats to, you no. Know, crossing that river will probably take most of that money away. Uh, this... The most efficient train line would be from Los Santos to Sandy Shores, but... Yeah, how much is that going to cost? And even if it costs less than half a million per in, the train alone is going to set us back 100,000 plus, probably half a million. So we just need more time to build up the money. So, yeah. I'm just trying to think if there's anything we can connect for cheap, and I don't think there is. The obvious culprit, and what's probably going to be next to hook up, is Elysian Island, but that's going to be expensive as well. You just saw 400000 for that bridge. Uh, what can we do? We're back into positive, only 500 quid, but you know. Um, what could we do? Um, Cypress Flats, La Mesa... Calafia Loop needs... No, Cypress Flats to Sandy needs more vehicles. Thank God that's starting to pick up. We haven't got enough yet, though. Nearly. 9,010. Come on, 11. 120,000 on the food line now. Can we get another one? Come on, 7,000. 8, 11, that just jumped for some reason, 12, 13, no, it's 13.7, there we go, set line, and you're going Cypress Flats to Sandy, uh, there you go, you know, we might be able to afford another one in a second, come on, 11, 2 grand more, come on, so 26, 13, there you go, perfect, and you're going Cypress Flats to Sandy. I think we're doing well, I think we're doing well, we just need to get through these first couple of years, just need to get through it. I'm desperate, I am thinking of another industry though, putting another industry in, maybe... This is maintenance as hell, though. Maybe fuel to Sandy Shores? That would be a good candidate for a train line. But to kick it off, maybe vehicle? I'm going to start laying the rest of this highway. A large country road. Straight away. Straight away it turns red. <laughs> 60,000 to bring it out like that. 21. I'm just going to lay it slowly over time, I think. I just want 20,000. Actually, no. I'd be better off spending that money on vehicles, I think. Until we get a good enough amount of money where we can put it in, in one or two large pieces. So, we got no money. We need. We just need more on the food line. It's about as simple as that. So, you know, why not? One. Come on, build up some cash. Uh, this is going on the great food. Perfect. Can we get another one? Might be able to get another one. Come on, ten thousand. Didn't mean to do that. 
11, 12, come on, nearly there. Just a big jump, yeah. Grape. Food. Hopefully the food line will get big enough that it will carry us on to get more industry, industry set up and they'll carry us on if you get what I'm saying. Like they'll provide the income to build more. I was just about to put another vehicle on then. That's annoying. I'm definitely doing better than I did in the first series. I can tell you that. Tell you that for nothing. Uh, great food. Every time we get a bit of money, I'm just going to add some vehicles where they're needed, I think. And then I can worry about building when we put other stuff in. What else is there? There's the construction materials. But then, yeah, these mountains here. Very nice and tree covered, but not very good for vehicles. Probably have to tunnel that. Oh, wow, we got 30,000. 31. So 24. So if I'm quick. One, two, three. Nope, not enough for three yet. Come on. Nine. Come on, please. Nah, you son of a gun. Ah, oh, well. At least the food line's doing well. In fact, it's doing very well. 131,000 now. Sandy Foods. Oh, we're starting to get stuff, though. That's good. Starting to... What's the... Uh, not that. The actual truck stop. Right, put 15. We need more vehicles for that. That is a fact. The frequency on it is one every six minutes. We need to increase that. We need food in the sandy. Because that will also put more uh, potential on the grape, grape seed food line. Because it'll have to carry more there and back in order to transfer it. So that's a good thing. One. That'll do for now. This is going on sandy food, pink line. Now we're down 15 grand. But I don't mind, we'll get it back. It's so It's so touchy this early on, because if you make a mistake, or if there's a glitch in one of your lines and it just breaks, you are screwed. Literally, there's nothing you can do pretty much. But as for plans for the future, my number one now is to get a train line going and profitable. So what I'm thinking, I need to, the best way to do that, we have half a million in reserve, build up half a million in cash, pay that back, and then we'll have a million spare, and then try and build the train line. And if we haven't got enough, take out half a million to finish the line, and then use the other half a million to buy our first train. That is how my thinking's going right now. We have 20,000. I know where this is going. One. Ah, you son of a gun. And yeah, I'm saying that in substitute for a B word. I don't like swearing much on my videos. I personally don't mind swearing, but you know, there might be kids watching or something. This is so touch and go at the moment. I think we're going to have enough for another vehicle though. What needs it the most? I'm thinking the Calafia loops. Look, they're both full. Okay. Let's do something about that. There's one. Set line. Calafia one. No, nope, not enough yet. Come on, it's the 20th. 11, 12, 13 point. There you go. Set line. Uh, Calafia two. Perfect. Right, I'm happy with how this is going, but OCD, oh, I need to connect those roads before it drives me mad and I spot it again. We just got negative, that's annoying. Every time I go do something, the month ends. No, not like that. Can't even see that. Where's, no, it's this road. That'll do. And down in Sandy. 15? Really? No way. Uh, oh well, that's what I meant to say. Nearly there. 11, 12, 
13, 14 and a half, 15, 2. Perfect. And 14 for that one, of course it is. And what just made it worse, we're about to go through a new year, which means 100,000, well, 95,000 is about to get taken out of our bank account. So I want this done quick. So if you could hurry up, please, Cash. Come on. 30th. Ah, no. Oh, just. Damn, that was close. That was close. And now we're down 110,000. Why the hell is it 110,000? Ah, oh, 15 for the vehicles as well. This is the end of the month. Damn. Right, one thing I am noticing, if we look at the bus stops down here, like that's got 40 people at it near enough. 20, 37. 37 people. So a lot of our lines, the capacity, the potential is more than the capacity. Like look down here. That one, 36. So we desperately need more vehicles on these lines. So I'm guessing you know what the next episode is going to be. So between now and then, I'm going to run on, let it run on, get some cash. And I will bring you back then. So thanks for watching, guys. Peace out.